to hit an aggressive shot from there and then step in. Yeah, I'm not sure he's going to be allowed to it step in. It was a great run from Gasquet, but he just missed. <laughs> oh, my. He does get the short ball. He can move forward. He just wants to stay back. Better when I move in. Yeah. Let me do that more often. Let's see if it sinks in. Well, not much he can do in that combination. Sensational. Yes. Yeah. That's so much a, spin. You have a high volley, it turns into a low volley within seconds. Hold my mind. I played him in doubles one time, couldn't hit a volley. Ball was dropping at my shoe tops. You'll see the movement and how important it is. Well, he's come. Five and flat cross court for winners now. Yeah, that was a big change. He always handed him a loss. Uh, toss starts getting too far right. Oh, that's a great finish, because it was a good luck. That was an entertaining set of tennis. They played some wonderful points, but for Gasquet, it was Nadal who was winning most of them. And Nadal doing so many things well there, but you have to be impressed also with how he's finishing things up at the net. And oftentimes he's just cleaning it up, something floating up there that he can just hammer into. Beat Marcos Bagdadis. Never been past the fourth round though in the singles. Now that's a good play. Time to Final catch up often, but you just can't do anything with his shots. Yeah, it's, a, it's an awesome forehand. Yeah. It all. It's well done. This time it's Nadal stepping up and taking it early. The only, he can try taking it early and slicing if he doesn't feel as though he can hit it.
got to be more willing to take <laughs> there, he wasn't there was no thought in Blake's mind of let me work the point yes first ball first ball get as hard as I can yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's three overheads at. Uh... Quick, a straight set win over Ernest Gulbis. Again, Gasquet. Yeah, I'm. Sound like a broken record. Said, I'm not going to give you what you want. It's funny as he started out forward, Gasquet. likes to get a doubles match in before he even plays singles in some of the yeah, tour level tournaments. We've never lost at that event in the singles. Had never lost three out of five sets. On well, sadly, sets, for, I believe. Yeah, handled him pretty comfortably. And hit clean winners and really turn that defense into offense. Oh, gee whiz, that's not going to win this set. It's not throwing it in, but there's not any urgency to his game. Nadal. Second set, Nadal, six games to two. Yeah, Nadal looking, again, so sharp, not only on the return, but on the pass. Get the second set stats. Yeah, and you can see Gasquet, some of those on force, to be fair, have been from this pressure that Nadal naturally. They just keep getting better. They start to pass. Do you feel that's one reason why Nadal... He was there, nearly. Dan See the boxer. Forty left. Not too many. To the court as if to say, I'm, I'm literally physically taking away your targets. Serve is called good for now. But I was challenging the call on the right. Compared to most of the other players, at least. His challenge has been more. And again, he heard this you. one, at least up two sets to love and on serve here. Gasquet serving at 3 4.
Yeah, his, um, Well, Nadal takes victory again at the U.S. Open. Great to have him back. 6-2, 6-2, and 6-3 over Gasquet. It was a perfect start for the Spaniard here in his quest to win a career Grand Slam. Perfect matchup for Nadal, the way the points went right from the start. You